Hi everybody, it's Richard here again and welcome to uh, my competition entry for Paul at 33 and a thirds 333 subscriber competition. Congratulations Paul, well deserved. Um, Paul has asked us to show three cover versions. One which is uh, not as good or nowhere near as good as the original. One which is on a par with the original, and uh, one which uh, you think uh, surpasses the original. So we'll start off <coughs> with um, the dreadful cover version first. Uh, this is T Rex's, uh, oh, the light's not too good in this, Electric Warrior album, and on this is their huge hit single, Get It On, Banger Gong, which was. Number one in the UK and a top ten is only top. Mark Bones only top ten in the states. Now on this CD, a band, a, funny enough, Paul showed the same band uh, for doing a different song from a different artist. On this CD of Parallel Lines by Blondie, they do a live version of uh, Get It On, and it is unlistenable. It is dreadful. Now there's been a few get it ons uh, done in the past. For example, um, the power station did a half decent version of it. I thought it was actually very good. Um, Frankie Goes to Hollywood did an okay version. But this I'm afraid, I love Blondie, but this I'm afraid is rubbish and I can't even get through the whole song. It's that bad. So um, I don't know what they were doing, putting it on. I can appreciate them having a go at it live. Adamant does a better live version than this. Um, awful. Totally awful. So that is my um, my uh, choice for terrible cover version. Next up is... I can get this right. Yeah. This is uh, Walls and Bridges by John Lennon. And on this album is the brilliant number nine dream surely nobody could do as good a version of number nine dream as john lennon himself surely not but yeah in my view yes and this one actually i would say nearly surpasses it but i'm going to put it as an equal and this may surprise but this is Andrea Kors lifelines album and she does an absolutely fantastic version of that song um, I, I, there's a video on YouTube and it's a custom made video and whoever made it has done such a fantastic job um, it may not be the best quality in uh, picture but it works so well with this song and I'm going to put the link and urge you to watch it just to show you that I'm not skitting here I really mean it there's a fantastic version and this album from 2011 is a really brilliant album as well. It's all cover versions. She does a magnificent version of Blue Bayou, uh, Roy Orbison's song. She even does the Velvet uh, Underground's Pale Blue Eyes, which is stunning. Uh, they Don't Know, which was the Kirsty McCall, which is very good. And there's another one here. Um, well, she does the Crystal Ship by the Doors. Uh, it was a bonus track among the other CDs, which is absolutely ph phenomenal. I love this album. Andrea Core solo album, all cover versions, but brilliant. And Number Nine Dream is my equal to cover version. So, better than. Okay. This is The Who's um, Meaty Beaty Big and Bouncy and their debut single is on this called I Can't Explain which is great. Can't fault it at all. Great bouncy number. But the improvement is by the master himself David Bowie on his pin-ups album and he transforms the song. He slows it down. He layers sax all over it. And it is oh it's fantastic um it re he really turns it into a real sexy song it's beautiful it's one of his best ever cover versions uh, um 
brilliant album this by the way um, he even played it live during the uh, Serious Moonlight tour I believe I think he played it live in Murrayfield Murray Stadium when I saw him but yeah it's my favourite Bowie cover version he's done quite a few cover versions some excellent like uh, Kingdom Come, uh, Wild as the Wind uh, some and see Emily play on this and here comes the night on this some not so good like um, God only knows by the Beach Boys but it's not as bad as people make out it's a bit schmaltzy but it's it's not bad I can see where he's coming from that. but anyway this is I can't explain um, fantastic fantastic cover so um, this is my choice for better than the original okay that was short and sweet so uh, again thanks Paul for setting up the competition and um, I hope you get many more subscribers and I hope actually to meet you sometime I hope we our paths cross in Johnny's record shop so um, anyway that's me for now so all the best cheers now bye bye